Hello and welcome back to the Okta support video series. Today we will show the new feature from Okta, the access testing tool. The feature allows administrators to test policies on how a user will log in into Okta or access an application, authenticating enrollment policies, and self-service enrollment into Okta. This is ideal when testing new configurations or troubleshooting a specific behavior for a user. At this moment, the feature is early access and it will require to be enabled from the Settings, Features, and Toggle the Enable Policy Testing and Simulation Tools option. With the feature enabled, the option can be seen in the Reports Access Testing Tool tab. The simulator asks the administrator to present a scenario and specify where the user is trying to log in and the user name. Those are the only required fields, but the admin has the option to populate multiple fields, such as device status, if the device is registered or not. If the option for the device is registered, the device management option will appear, and the admin can specify if the device is managed or not. If any device assurance is set up, they can be specified. Please note adding the device assurance policy in the scenario represents that the device is compliant with that policy not evaluated by it. The device platform, the IP address, or a specific network zone. Network zones can also include geolocation network zones, not only IP's network zones, and the risk score of the request between low, medium, and high. At this moment, the feature is in early access and the custom expression option is not available. This leverages the Okta expression language to add another characteristic to the scenario. As a test scenario, we will show when a user is trying to access the Okta dashboard, and we add our test user as an example. We set the device as registered, but not managed. We do not have any device assurance policies set up, but we specify the user is using a Windows device. They are trying to access the Okta dashboard from the geolocation network zone of our office, and the risk is low. After we run the test, we can see the user is allowed access to the Okta dashboard, his group membership, the enrolled authenticators for that user, and this profile attributes. On the right, we can see if there are any missing required attributes or authenticators. Below, we can see the policies that apply to that user, the authentication policies which include the authentication policy and the global session policy, the authenticator enrollment policy, and the enrollment policy or self-service registration. The process can be seen in two modes, the sign-in journey view where the policies are shown based on the process they have been evaluated, or the list all view where the policies are all listed in one place. Thank you for watching. For more Okta support videos, check out the Okta support playlist right here on the Okta YouTube channel.